A wet day and now a rainy night here in North London. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And we're ready for UEFA Champions League group stage action tonight. It is Tottenham Hotspur up against Sporting. Well, Derek, both teams played really well last time out, but something has to give here today. I'm looking forward to this one. It should be a great contest. And the starting 11 for Spurs. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Pierre-Emil Hoybier plays with Rodrigo Bentancur in the centre of midfield. And up front today, Hyung min Son plays with Harry Kane. Here's the lineup for Sporting. Well, I'm intrigued to see how their two midfield players cope in there today because they look very isolated. Yes, they're good athletes and skillful players, but it's asking an awful lot of them. And this Champions League group stage contest commences. Morita. And that'll be offside. Well, slightly off target, and that'll be a throw-in. Romero. It's with Bentancur. And Sporting doing well to win possession. He's in here. Well, here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. Back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Nuno Santos. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Options in the middle. He takes aim, and no way through. Kane saw his pass intercepted. Chances on. Couldn't grab hold of it. 
Well, nothing untoward happened. Well, what a brilliant save that was. How did he keep that out? Well, on the back of that breathtaking piece of goalkeeping, can they keep the ball and create? Kane. Now, looking dangerous here. Rivière. Has a go! Really sound defending. Kane. Well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. And with the goalkeeper. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. And Spurs moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Ready to fire. Oh, a fantastic save. Offside, not that anyone knew. Nuno Santos. Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. Son. And Son! And rattling the post. Well, had that gone in, the game was firmly in their hands. Now, though, they've got to make sure they don't let this slip. And scope for them to produce something exciting. And let's give credit to the defending. And held with ease by Loris. Kulusevski. Well, couldn't keep it in. Son. And he takes it on. Oh, excellent diving stop. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Just over the top in the end. Well, Spurs have dominated the flow of the game in the last 15 minutes or so, and their passing patterns... Have now, hold on, Stuart, they're in here. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. Who can they pick out? The save was a good one. Another corner. Well, still an issue here. Son. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Read it superbly to take back possession. Harry Kane slips it through. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Marcus Edwards. And giving it away. Javier. They've chosen to go through Harry Kane. Options around him. He's in behind. And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender is just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. underway with the lead standing at 2-0 determined defending well Spurs now in potentially a dangerous position Son 
Well, it might still work out for them. Fabien. On to Bentancourt. Oh, the goalkeeper did well to hang on to that one. Almost at half-time, and they're making home advantage count, I think it's fair to say. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, they're dominating this first half. Their approach play, their cleverness around the box, and the finishing have been excellent. They just need to continue this going into the second period. And they couldn't keep possession. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. Perisic. And a decent delivery. Across, lacking guile and accuracy. No more time left. That is it for the first half here at the home of Tottenham. Well, he's a player who seems to get better with age and really prospering in this match, Hyung Min Son. Well, the keeper will be sick at the sight of him. He's been shooting from everywhere and he's taken his goals really well. And they get the ball rolling in this Champions League. So the ball is moving again. Spurs having already made a big first half statement here. Hector Bellerin. Marcus Edwards. Veering in field here. And that's a, well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. Good bit of pressing. Keeper did his job to begin with. Well, the goalkeeper got there in the end. Well, his recovery is brilliant here. So athletic. Making a bit of headway. And his teammate got him out of trouble. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And he's made headway. And it's there for him. And there it is! Three goals in front now. An immense performance. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And the finish from Kane is excellent. He times his run, he finds that bit of space, and he was never going to miss that. Now they get the ball moving once more, and this is turning into a trouncing. Spurs hold all the aces. Son. Now with Kane. Just wanted to get it out of there. Just a quick reminder, we've got Champions League group stage action for you to look forward to here on EA TV. It's Spurs up against Olympique Marseille. I like the look of that game. The atmosphere is always good inside that stadium and two very good teams. Teammates available. Can he take the chance? A oh, tremendous block. Ivan Perisic has space for them here on the flank. The fine cross. Well, you have to categorise that as a missed opportunity. Thirty minutes to go. Then, how well, far from the ideal pass? Kane, and now Perisic. Splendid defending. Hoybier. Oh, big opportunity! Well, the post getting in the way there. Well, it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Oh, 
Well, can they exploit the space out wide? It's looking promising. And fine goalkeeping. Let's see about the delivery. It might still be problematic. Not a time for cool heads. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? They need to get bodies back. Chance here. Oh, must be. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. But I think the defending is poor. How can the goalkeeper be left so exposed with two players running at him? Mind you, it's still a great team goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Making progress. Now let's see about the cross. And held with ease by Loris. Pedro Porro. Ivan Perisic. And showing fine vision. Well, it all counts for naught. Well, the seconds are ticking away, and the home side in control. Stuart, oh, he's through on goal here, Derek. And the ball is loose, and a goal it is, but offside is the verdict. Well, it's a good finish, but he was just offside. Great decision by the assistant. Son with the pass, but not what he had in mind. And a throw in for Sporting. Jeremiah St. Justa. Really good interception. Attending to his defensive chores. Marcus Edwards. And not hitting it with the accuracy he was hoping for. Well, he took... a chance there and he probably regrets it now that was the wrong decision Bisuma. And now with Kulusevsky. Another perfect position to read it. Out of play. And a Spurs throw in forthcoming. Bentancur. Beautifully disguised ball. 
And the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say, Derek, he was always in control of that situation. Brilliant stuff. And over it comes. Well, not the best clearance. Has a go. Just made sure nothing came of that. And a goal to delight the fans. Just what they were hoping for. Well, here's the replay, and you can see why the manager is furious. It's just really poor play, offering up possession far too easily in a dangerous area. And at this level, if you keep doing that, you're going to get punished. It's just not good enough. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Ugarte. It's with Nuno Santos. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. Well, it looks highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Well, he was being pressed, but did his job. Oh, what an opportunity. And still danger here. And there goes the final whistle. The overall story is a happy one for Tottenham because they get the three points from this game. What did you make of it? Well, it's two from two, and they're in the driving seat now. They just need to take this form into the next couple of games, and they'll be in the knockout stages. Well, I think as we reflect on the game, we can say that Hyung Min Son will have pleased as manager. Interested to get your thoughts on his contribution? Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is. goalkeeping well it's a top class save from a top class goalkeeper that's absolutely brilliant hey Bier. they've chosen to go through harry kane options around him he's in behind and he's made it a brace for himself the defender is just unable to stay with him and he's made headway Three goals in front now. An immense performance. It's looking promising. Chance here. Oh, must be. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. And the ball is loose. And a goal it is. But offside is the verdict. Well, it's a good finish, but he won't. Well, not the best clearance. Has a go. And a goal to delight the fans, just what they were hoping for.